RMO. Um, yeah, yes, RMO was a five star mini version setup. So it was down what? One, two, three, four, five days in a row. Was down what? 52% from the highs. Yeah, five star. Five star. Opening range highs was the entry. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Really, this one I, I didn't even look at because it's too liquid for me personally. But yeah, five star. Yes, 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 yes. Five star mini version play. It's the same principle on this longs and shorts. You know, something that's up a lot in, you know, four. If, so if something is up a lot, like three, four, five days in a row, you know, it's not going to keep up going up that up forever. And the same thing with these things that make big moves and then have these big uh, moves down. Like, there's a good probability they will bounce. They don't have to. That's why you wait for these perfect setups where you have a good risk reward. If you're wrong, you only lose a little. You trail your mini version trades. Uh, you can use like... Yeah, well, you, you have to like uh, cover into weakness, short, uh, sell into strength. Um, that's what you have to do. And then it just slowly move your stop up. I don't really use any of these moving averages that much on the universe and trades.